The rumble of Tacoma Solid Waste Fleet is changing to a more environmentally friendly tone. The city's new solid waste collection trucks are bringing sustainability and cost efficiency to the road with the addition of eight CNG and another eight hydraulic hybrid trucks over the next year. CNG stands for compressed natural gas. The engine on a CNG truck has to burn at a higher temperature. And that's because CNG being a cleaner fuel burns at a higher temperature. Hybrid trucks really thrive in heavy stop and go environments. The engine is used to energize pressured accumulators and store energy. And that stored energy is used to help propel the truck, thereby reducing the total fuel consumption. It's estimated there will be a reduction of 90 pounds of carbon dioxide per day per truck through the replacement of the current diesel run fleet with these alternative fuel and emerging technology vehicles. Compressed natural gas vehicles emit about 90% less particulate matter than a conventional diesel engine. And so that's about 22 pounds less of particulates in the air every year per vehicle. There are a number of goals that the city is trying to reach through the addition of these vehicles, including the important undertaking of clean air attainment. Clean air attainment is meeting the standards that set by EPAs for air quality. And in 2009, the city of Tacoma and parts of Pierce County were declared in non-attainment because of high levels of very fine particulates in the air. These particulates primarily come from uncertified wood stoves and from diesel vehicles. So in 2015, due to efforts by the city and the county, we were declared into a maintenance mode, so that means we meet the standards, but we have to demonstrate that we'll comply for the next 10 years. This $4.2 million capital investment also includes the addition of a CNG fueling station on site at the Tacoma Recovery and Transfer Center. After the collector drivers get back from their routes, they come here, they plug in uh, to the CNG fuel line, and then the fuel station will start pumping the natural gas into the vehicles. That takes about four to six hours, and that'll be every night, so the trucks are ready to go the next day. One million of this investment is going towards future improvements to the fleet shop, so trucks can be serviced on site, further adding to the efficiency of the utility. Some future improvements to the fleet shop would include natural gas detectors, required so the mechanics can do work on the CNG trucks indoors or in the shop, and then also improvements to the ventilation system to circulate the air in the fleet shop. Depending on fuel prices, there's an expected return on investment in seven to 12 years, leading to benefits of the environmental and ratepayer kind. One other benefit of the hydraulic hybrid trucks is they tend to operate at a lower operating or noise level. With trucks that don't make as much noise in the neighborhoods, I'm sure our ratepayers and customers would like quieter collection environment on their collection day.